And think about this guy's problem. The guy who owns this trailer, he woke up, he was probably going to his truck where his trailer is attached to in the morning, and his trailer is missing. Welcome back to Building My Business, Friday edition. So I drove to work like I normally do every single day. And as I pull up to our business park, I see this trailer, this black trailer, parked in front of my dock door. So I've been renting out of my new location here for about a year now. And this business park is pretty professionally ran. So it was a shock to me to see someone would park and take up both of my dock doors. So I parked my car and I decided to kind of look at this trailer just to see what is going on, who would park here. And as I took a little bit more time to investigate, the plates were missing, the side door, it, it was unlocked. So I decided to open it. And as you guys can see, it was pretty much stripped down. So connecting all the dots, obviously this trailer belonged to maybe some construction company some entrepreneur with all of his tools in there i can imagine thousands and thousands of dollars worth of tools so today i want to talk about this i want to talk about putting your business problems into perspective so when i when i wake up in the morning normally i take my son to the bus stop i already mentally know that anything that could possibly happen, any negative thing at work, any problems will immediately hit me the second I walk through the door. Sometimes as in my situation, being an e-commerce seller, we like to complain about the smallest things. Customers returning used items, metrics that Amazon or eBay or Walmart has put onto us, just how things are unfair, the tariffs and the, the political war with China. All these are problems, but let's just pause and think about this guy's problem. The guy who owns this trailer, he woke up, he was probably going to his truck where his trailer is attached to in the morning and his trailer is missing. So just imagine this guy who possibly could have been an entrepreneur Dri driving this trailer full of like like thousand dollars worth of his tools to make a living for himself and his family and he wakes up and his trailer is gone just imagine that guy's problem so put your problems put my problems into perspective and just be grateful that you're in the game obviously what i did was i called the police the police since this was on private property, just so you guys know if you guys run into the same problem, you guys found a trailer, the police came and they said that there was no plate on it and the VIN number was scratched off. So what that meant was the police couldn't uh, call or use their towing services. So obviously these criminals were uh, prepared. You know, they took the plate off they scraped off the VIN number so there was no evidence. So I guess when they're they're towing it, even if they got pulled over, I don't know if they would get into a lot of trouble besides not having a plate. But anyways, I had to call my landlord and my landlord uh, called the company to tow it. So just so you know, if you guys are renting, uh, you know, a warehouse uh, in, a, in a business park, you can't physically call to have it towed. You have to have your landlord call to have a toad but going back to my point I was making before I got distracted just think about this you're you're going to work just expect that there will be challenges on a daily basis I can let you guys know in the last five days there has been a lot of new challenges that have popped up but what I try to do is I try to think about how grateful I am them healthy enough just to be in the game my game my business game and again if you just put it into perspective and compare yourself to this guy where I would imagine all of his life tools were in this trailer someone stripped it down threw it in front of a business park and just took off you know that's unfair you know that's that's unfair I'm not saying that's life 
but I'm saying that's unfair. So that's my business tip. It's kind of on a so somber note. I feel bad. I really wanted to like help the police uh, get these guys. You know, we have a bunch of cameras all over our office, all over our warehouse, but these guys were lucky that my cameras didn't catch them, pull up and drop off this trailer. But I just wanted to give this tip to you guys to let you guys know that we're all gonna run into problems every single day, especially if you're running your own business, no matter what the business is. But just put your business problems into perspective. So thank you guys for watching my content. Until next Friday, like this video if you guys like it. If you guys wanna hear more, I'm here every Friday. Until then, I will see you guys next Friday on Building My Business.